Hi friends, this is your tech expert Neil and you are watching howisol.com. In today's video, I'll show you how to hide this new watermark that Windows 11 has added. That is, system requirement is not met. And we'll, I'll show you, it's very simple. Um, this will be a quick two minutes video. So let's get started. Okay friends, with the latest Windows 11 update, you might find this kind of watermark at the bottom near your system tray which says system requirement is not met. Go to settings to learn more. I'll show you zoom in. You can see this is the problem. And when you go into settings, you'll see over here also the same thing is said, system requirements not met. So we'll fix this, it's quite easy to fix. You'll have to simply add a registry key and this banner should go away. So we'll do that. There are two methods for doing this. One is to simply copy paste the command in an administrative command prompt, which will automatically add the registry key to your Windows registry. We'll follow this first method. So let's close this. And to do that, click on this magnifying glass over here and type in CMD. Then right click and select run as administrator. Click yes. And then copy this command from the video description. It will be down in the video description. You can press Ctrl V or right click the mouse button to paste the copied command like this. Now basically what it does is it adds a registry key. You can see the location of the key. It is in H key current user control panel. And then there is this new key which is added with this latest Windows update that is unsupported hardware notification cache. And the value of the key which will be changing is SV2. And the value where we have to change from one to zero. So enter this command and just hit enter and then reboot your system. And after reboot, this particular watermark from your system should go away. If you are not comfortable with copying a command, I'll show you how you can do it manually using the registry editor. So let's do that. This is the second method for solving it. We'll be doing the same thing. Just manually we'll be up doing the changes. So to do that again, click on the search button over here and type in REGEDIT and this registry editor should pop up. Click on it. Then it will ask for administrative privileges. Click on yes. And then you have to go in H key current user. Click here to open it up and then in control panel, open control panel. And then over here you, you might see this key or it might be that you may not see this key. In that case, you have to create this key. Create it, you have to simply right click over here and then select new and then click on the key and then type the name unsupported. Make sure to type the correct spellings and the correct case because this, this is case sensitive. Unsupported hardware this unsupported hardware notification cache once the key is created or if you already have that key present in this you'll find a value of sv2 if you do not find this thing you have to create this also to create this simply right click new and then select dvot 32 bit value and name this sv2 since in my system it's already present i will just cancel it out and delete this and after that you have to make sure that the value is set to zero. If it's one, then you have to change it to zero. So simply double click and then change the value from one to zero like this and then hit OK. And again, you have to restart the system. And after restart, this particular watermark should vanish from both your desktop as well as your settings. I hope friends you like this quick tutorial of getting rid of this annoying watermark. If yes, smack that like button, share this video with your friends and family and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel howasol.com. We'll be sharing more such informative troubleshooting guides and tech tutorials. So keep watching howasol.com. This is Neil signing off. Bye.